The important thing about Nicholas Baratashvili is his uniqueness. Uh, suddenly, in the Caucasus, there appears a romantic poet of a rather European kind, out of nowhere apparently, and in the course of a very short period, uh, he, he died young of malaria, he, he produces a small body of work which is extraordinary. It's had an enormous influence not only in Georgia but also in Russia and in other countries. Um, it's been translated into French and into German. It hasn't, however, been properly translated into English, which is why I think Baratashvili deserves some publicity in this country, and it is, after all, the 200th anniversary of his birth. I enjoy translating poetry. The problem with it is that there are some poems that just will not translate. The other problem is that uh, it's not like translating prose. It can take a year or more before you get a satisfactory arrangement. So what I have ready are a few poems which I've only spent a few weeks on, so that they should be regarded mercifully as work in progress. But I think they give some idea of what Bharatashvili is about, and they will, people will immediately see that he's actually in some ways surprisingly close to poets he would never have read, that is English romantics.